Good morning and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League. Today we will see the completion of Group C and Group B and we will know our lineup for Champions Week Finals Night which commences at 10 o'clock tomorrow night. Well, the action got underway Tuesday morning, uh, yeah, Tuesday morning, 9.30 a.m. with Group A and it was Nathan Gervin who prevailed to take his spot in the final but this one went down to the wire as Nathan Gervin and Chaz Barstow clashed in the final match Wednesday afternoon to decide who won Group A. Well, on Thursday, the action got underway with Group B. And it is Daryl Pilgrim, who met, which may be a little bit of a shock. He certainly wasn't really in there uh, in the mix in terms of the book is prices, but he is top overnight with six points and plus six, winning three out of four, as did Scott Williams, but he's six behind on the leg difference. Stephen Burton on four points, Jazz Barstow on four, and the big shock, Jim McEwen did not pick up a win all night. Yesterday, we started Group C, which we will complete over the next five hours or so. And it was Graham Usher out on top, losing just one match. Kieran Tian right in there, winning three of his matches. Peter Jakes winning two, Warby winning two, Walters winning two, and Furness winning two. Remember, it's the top three from Group B, which will be completed this evening. And it's the top two from Group C. As I said, we will know three of the six in around about five hours hours time so here's the lineup for the day and it is Furness against Tian Usher against Warby and Waters against Peter Jakes that's the opening matches of the session looking at the odds for this session it is Ryan Furness, who starts our first match against Kieran Tehan, he's eleven to ten. Tehan is four to six, and then Graham Usher, who was the dominant force yesterday, he's eight to eleven favourite to beat Warby. And Warby started strongly yesterday. His opening two matches, he averaged a hundred and two and a hundred and five, and then that third match of the session, Waters against Peter Jakes. 8 to 11, Scott Waters, and value there for me, Peter Jakes, even money. So, without further ado, let's get today's action underway with Ryan Furness against Kieran Tehan. Here is Ryan Furness. This is Kieran Tehan, the young man from Cork. Twenty-eight from Salisbury is uh, twenty gram phase one at James Wade Dart, a Challenge Tour semi finalist. And this is High Tower. No surprise with that nickname. A Challenge Tour winner is a twenty-three gram. Target dart and 22. Confirmation of that table. Usher out in front, but a chance for Tehan early on to put a bit of pressure on Usher and put a bit of a gap between himself and Peter Jakes. Remember, top two only will qualify for Saturday night's final. We have 15 matches to bring you from this session. And tonight from 10 p.m. again on Sporty Stuff TV, we'll be bringing you the final 10 matches from Group B. And that all starts with Stephen Burton up against Jim McEwen. Can Jim McEwen somehow 
Well, he's going to have to win four out of four for me, starting with that match at 10 o'clock tonight. Leg, Don't forget the Euro Tour. First game on. Gets underway at midday. I will bring you the results as they happen. And then this evening, 7 o'clock. 100. It is the start of the World Seniors Masters from Lakeside. One hundred and twenty five. There is still action from there. When we go on air, I will keep you up to speed with the results from there as well. Fifty. Fifty six. Ninety-seven. Eighty-three. Ninety-three. This was, of course, our final Brian, you require match yesterday. Tian had the darts in that one and came out a 4-1 winner, averaging 86.83 hit 4 180s. Used 10 darts at a double in that one, hence the average, 86.83. It was a, a far better scoring performance 100. than the average suggests. Brian, you require 31. Furness averaged 76.57, one from three on the doubles, no Game shot the first leg, Ryan Furness. Bright start to this one, a 17 dart hold of throw in leg one. Kieran Tian has the darts in leg two. Second leg, it's Kieran to throw first. Kieran's average for the day yesterday, 86.99. Ryan Furness, 83.6. 97. 180s for Ryan yesterday. Kieran Tian, 7. Peter Jakes, 12. 96. <coughs> Scott Walters didn't hit a single 180 all day yesterday. 100. 96. Eighty five. One hundred. One hundred and eighty. So the first one of this match. First one of the day, and in comes the second one. 180. Kieran, you require 39. A bit of pressure on this now after the max from Furness. He knows he can't afford to miss. And he Game doesn't. shot in the second leg. Kieran Very Tian. solid 15 dart hold to throw from Kieran Tian. Levels this opening match up. 1-1. One, one. Third leg, it's Ryan to throw first. Eighty-five. Very solid start from both. Ryan Furness on four points. One hundred. Effectively joint third, only separated by leg difference. Get a win here against Tian because you'd fancy Tian to take points off a couple of the other players. See this one ending up seriously tight for that 
91. Second spot. I'm not saying that Usher's going to run away with it, but he did average 90 for the day yesterday. A high of 103.8. Hit 7180. 60. 35% on his doubles. I think three wins from five. Pretty much guarantee 122. Usher his spot. Two wins would put him on 12 points, which generally is the kind 59. of number that gets you through Group C. A real big 140. match for both coming up, of course, as Graham Usher faces Mike Warburton. Usher won that tie. It was our penultimate game of the day yesterday. Usher winning 4 2 with a 103.8 average. Kieran, you require 48. Mike Warburton, not too shabby. He was 2 out of 2 on his doubles, an average 96. Game shot in the third leg. Kieran Tian. That is our first break of throw in the match. And it goes by the way of the Irishman. 14 darter to back Fourth up the 15 dart two, hold all first. in leg two. One hundred and eighty. Oh, he's in the mood today. One hundred and forty. One hundred and twenty three. One hundred. Kentian not made a, a champions week this year, the finals. Ninety eight. Looking to put that right today. One hundred and eighty. Kieran, you require one hundred. For the second time, they both hit a one eighty in the game shot. The fourth leg. leg. Kieran Tien with an eleven dart hold a throw takes a three one lead, winning legs of fifteen, fourteen, and eleven for Kieran Tian. Fifth leg, Ryan to looking good. good. Look at that average, one hundred and five point one one. 57. Tihan is best in the live league in terms of average, 100.2. Well, that is under threat here. He could produce a new PB. 96. Fifty-eight. Ninety-nine. Sixty. One hundred and eighty. Is one eighty number three? One hundred and eighty. Oh, happened again. Kieran, you require sixty-seven for the third time in this match. One eighties forty-two up in the same leg. 
Tee and misses the ball. Ryan, you require eight. So four, one win. Game shot at the fifth leg. Wait. Ryan Finesse. Because that's a 16 dart hold from Ryan Finesse. But it is Tihan with the darts in leg six. Sixth leg will be Kieran Tooth for all first. One hundred and thirty five. One hundred and eighty. We've now had seven in the match. Eighty one. 'est we've ever seen in the 83 live league and there's well, potentially one more leg to play 180 and for the fourth time players have replicated each other in the same leg in terms of the 180 90. Kieran, you require 105. Not to win it in some style. And create a new PB in terms of average. Double 18, double 16 to finish. An absolute blinder. Game shot and the match. Kieran Tien. Young man, a 12 dart hold of throw to win it. And a 105 checkout. Well, the match produced eight 180s, an average for Ryan Furness of 99.65, which really would be normally more than enough to win a match here at the Live League. But it's Kieran Tien with a personal best, 106.24, beating his previous PB by some six points, doubling from both superb. Two from two for Furness, four out of six for Kieran Tien as he joins Graham Usher on eight points. And we're going to see Graham Usher in our next match as he takes on Mike Warburton.
Good morning and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League. And as the saying goes, follow that. Well, if two players can possibly follow that, it's the next two with Graham Usher against Mike Warburton. Just to confirm, that is the highest of mount, amount of 180s in a match in Phase 1, 2 or 3 of this year. It's not a record, of course. We've had 12 matches with eight or more the best is nine which was andy jenkins against josh payne josh payne hitting seven on his own and jason askew and alan monk also first leg it's graham to throw first it was game a on. wonderful match congratulations to kieran tihan on a personal best high average here at the live league 106.24 41 four one eight is four out of six on the doubles and a high finish of 105 it was an outstanding display well, talking of 180s 59 graham usher in his last 12 matches in the live league it's hit at least one 180 140 in each of those 12 matches which sounds impressive enough however a player up next in match number three six involves scott waters and peter jakes peter jakes is it at least one 180 in his last 81. 17 matches here at the live league One hundred and forty. One hundred and thirty-four. Did play very well yesterday. Graham Usher averaged nearly ninety for the day, as I mentioned a little earlier. Warby. One hundred three. Graham, you require one hundred and five for the day. Highest of all the players, just in front of Scott Walters, who 65. was bottom overnight with a 93.01 for the day. 142. Warby also topped the doubling table, 50% on his 60. doubles over the course Graham, of require the whole 40. session. Had a best leg of 10 darts against Scott Walters. Game shot the first leg, Graham Usher. Here's Graham Usher. Old throw in leg one. Now Warby needs to get into this match and quick. Second leg, Mike to throw first. Sixty. One hundred and thirty seven. Two ten darters this week. One hundred. Last two weeks we've had a dart missed at double twelve by Nathan Gervin for the nine. And of course this week there's a fifteen hundred pound bonus on the line for the nine. Charles Barstow went oh so close. One hundred. Forty-one. Just worth looking across all the stats from that opening match. A game that would well, be more than good enough to grace any stage in World Darts. Sixty. Or any platform, should I say. Game played at the highest quality. 43. full-time jobs 100 they must have incredible bosses 41 make you require 81 
149. He was 32. Graham, you require 139. On 139. He had a high finish yesterday of 145. 99. Mike, you require 32. Which was the highest finish of the session. Game shot in the second leg. Mike Warburton. Plus finishes as Mike Warburton holds throw in leg two. It's felt like this could be a tight one. Third leg, Graham throwing first. 100. 100. Said Scott Waters against Peter Gates. One hundred and eighty. Graham Rusher's run of one eighties continues. That's thirteen matches now. He's at least one. One hundred and forty. One hundred and forty. So I like Peter Jakes in the next one. Even money to 100. Scott Walters, who's the eight. Graham, you require one hundred and twenty-one. Fifty-seven. Make you require one hundred and sixty-one. Ninety. Bit of pressure on Graham the 64. 64. Of picking off the ball there. Single 16 leaves double 16. Game shot in the third leg. Graham Usher. He held it all together very well there, did Graham Usher. Mike Warburton, Warburton threatening to break throw. It is Warby to Fourth start leg, leg four. Mike to throw first. Not a 15 dart hold, including a 180 in leg three for Graham Usher. 100. 180. 81. A defeat here for Wolvey. He'll have to win the remaining four matches he's 60. got to play in this group C. I think he has to win four out of five today to stand any chance. 140. 64. Forty-one. Ninety-five. Well, Make you require one hundred and thirty-nine. A bit of pressure. Seventy-nine. Trouble thirteen, possibly. He's just missed it. Seventy-nine. Even off sixty. Graham, you require one hundred and two. 62. Tops. Mike, Something you require 60. A bit of a disaster. 20 and tops. There's the 20. So gets two darts in hand. Double 10. 50. He's clipped the inside one. Graham, wire. you require so 40. Aggressively thrown dart. Game shot the in the fourth leg. Graham Usher. Graham Usher. Two missed darts at a double. Could prove massively costly. Fifth leg, Graham throwing first. One hundred. Averages climbing steadily. One 
100. Ninety-nine. Oh shit, just that little bit more clinical on the doubles. Three from seven. Forty-two point eight six percent. One from 100. three for Warby. Thirty-three point three three percent. Fifty-six. Fifty-nine. Fifty-five. Eighty-five. Thirteen's the shot. One hundred and thirty-two. Mike, you require one hundred and fifty-seven. I think Usher will be back at fifty-eight, and he will for the match. So should get two darts at tops to 59. wrap it up. Four-one, and Graham, you one step 58. closer to qualifying for tomorrow. Game shot in the match. Final. Graham Usher. Graham Usher, very tidy indeed. Solid if not spectacular, winning in legs of 18, 15, 17, and 17, an average of exactly 29 per dart, 87. Two 180s, 1140, 50% on the doubles, and he moves on to 10 points. Up next, a big one, Scott Walters against Peter Jakes. <laughs>
Good morning and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League brought to you on Sporty Stuff TV. Up next, match number three and it's Scott Walters against Peter Jakes. Yeah, our top two overnight have done the business in their opening matches. Kieran Tian defeating Ryan Furness. Had a tremendous performance and... Graham Usher defeating Mike Warburton 4-1. First leg will be Scott to throw first. Game on. Scott won this tie yesterday against the darts 4-3. One hundred and forty. Did have a wonderful average in that match yesterday. Ninety six for Walters, ninety two for Peter Eighty one. One hundred and forty. Can Peter Jakes continue? One hundred and forty. Of at least one one eighty. In his last 17 matches in the Live League. 99. Back-to-back -back 140s to start the opening leg. Just lost the line. Recovers well. 123. And, uh, 98 after 9. 70. Peter, you require 98. Possible with a modern data. 54 for 24, and 20 for tops. And then 58. It's fingers crossed. Scott, you require 110. Scott doesn't take out. 110. Didn't have a 180 yesterday, but he had three ton plus outs. Game shot in the first leg. Scott Walters. That's a fourth in this Group C. Another time to get it. Peter Jakes waiting on top. Second leg, Peter throwing first. For the break of throw. 140. It's teasing us now. 123. 123. Peter Jake scoring in this match so far. Comes 60. A little bit special. 5 scores of a ton or more. Well, I put the jinx on that, haven't I? 30. <laughs> 5 scores of a ton or more in one and a bit legs. As soon as I mention it, his worst 45. visit to the board. Fortunately for him, so did Walters. 60. It's a horrible deflection, that one. 34. Oh, hang on, a finish. 58. 64 points in his last six starts. Peter Jakes needs to regroup. 58. 95. Peter, you require 116. He left. Should be treble 18. Could be ball. 44. Scott, you Scott require 120. Him here. He is unsettled. Walters has just taken out 110. Can he take out 120? 45. PT requires 72. 
Needs to settle it. Wants tops. Game Gets shot tops. The second leg. Peter Jakes. Well, it was a pretty horrendous leg. But it's a holder throw, more importantly, for Peter Jakes. And that will Third settle leg. him Scott down a bit. First. He took about 23 points off of his 58. average. Prior to me mentioning his scoring, he was averaging... 120, which was just an example of the start he made. 140. 123. Doesn't hit a lot of 180s. Scott Walters' darts are a fairly flat lie. 140. Pick up a little, or he leaves a, a lot of room. He will go for the cover, and now he'll stay there, because there is so much room. There's a perfect example of what I was talking about. 180. As he finds his first 180. That's his first 180 in this Group C. 140. Scott, you require 140. Try again. 19. 82. So, Peter, you require 81. It's a break throw for Peter Jakes. 12 and ball. Double 13. 55. Scott, you require 58. 48. Never looked convincing there, did he? Peter, you require 26. Has to attack this. And Game does. shot in the third leg. And Peter that is Jakes. The break of throw. Peter Jakes needs. It came in 13 darts, not before. Walters. Had two darts to hold. It's Peter Jakes Fourth with the advantage. Two, Leads 2-1 and now has the darts in leg four. 96. 80. 180. So, Peter Jakes makes it 18 consecutive matches in the live league with at least one 100. 180. Absolutely incredible stat, that. 140. Eighty-one. Peter, you require eighty-five. Sixty-six. Could be ball. Could be trouble ten. Could be forty-two for twenty-four. Forty-five. He's left tops. One hundred. Peter, you require forty. Game shot the fourth leg. Peter Jakes. That is back to back. Thirteen dart legs for Peter Jakes. He leads three one. He's one away. Fifth leg it's Scott to so want more up. darts when we come off air at two o'clock. Look at those numbers. 86, and that's with a 21 leg in leg two. As I mentioned, the European tour continues starting today at midday. 100. You can watch that, of course, via pdc.tv. You can get a weekend pass to watch that. 60. Some great matches this afternoon. Kutchmar against Lennon, Williams, Edhouse, Bolton, Meikle, 
Connor Scott, Scott Waits, Kevin Burness, a lively regular against Ross 45. Smith, Andrew Gilding, Wesley Plazer, Daniel Larson against Mario Vanden Bogarde, and the youngster 135. Sebastian up against Yella Klassen, who qualified yesterday, I do believe, as a home nation qualifier. Got a 41. great chance tonight to watch either some of the old guard playing at Lakeside before we come back on air at 10 o'clock. 97. Or if you want to see some of the current players, Nicky Mansell against Zonneveld, Watermina, Rennie Edems, Belmont 85. against King, Whitlock against Scott, you Hughes, require 110. Cracker, Klimacher, Rids, Nopper, Contamon, Danny Janssen, Against Vincent van der Voort and Dave Chisnell against Maros Rasva. 42. A literal feast of darts on offer. 60. Scott, you require 68. You need multiple screens. 52. 70 for Peter, you require Peter 170. Jakes. 60. Jamie Claire. Scott, you require Not 16. Had a ton plus finish yesterday, Peter Jakes. Game shot in the fifth leg. Scott Walters. Scott Walters with a 20 dart leg holds throw in leg five, but the big leg coming up next for Peter Jakes is he has the darts to win it 4 2. Sixth leg, Peter throwing first. One hundred. One hundred and forty. And then tonight, of course, prior to us going on air. 7 o'clock, BT Sport, Paul Lim against John Park, Painter against David Cowan, Roland Shulton against Wayne Jones, and then Phil Taylor against the winner of Lim and Part. 42. And tomorrow afternoon, if you want more Tungsten, it's Ashton against O'Shea, Terry Jenkins, Richie Howson, Peter against Colin Monk, to bring you that depends on one of the results from the Friday night. 129. Has to be careful here, Peter Jakes. Can't afford a slip up. Oh dear. 100. Oh, he's got very, very lucky there. A single 20. And he would have been on a bogey. Been on 140. Now this 119. Has to go. 62 left. 12 ball. Trouble 13. Uh, uh, trouble 12. Double 13. And he's missed a match start on the inside wire. Scott, you, you require do not 50. expect Walters to miss this. 42. Wow. He can't believe it. Peter, you require 13. Five. For double four. He made sure of that. Game and shot and a match. Peter sure Jakes. of that. Congratulations if you followed my advice there and you took Peter Jakes on at even money. He ends up winning that tie 4-2 with a 91.15. one one eighty apiece. 7-3 to three in the 140 column in favour of Peter Jakes. Great finishing. Four out of six. 66.67 percent. Right when we come back, Warby's back in action against Ryan Furness.
morning and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League. Up next, match number four of 15 and it's Ryan Finesse against Mike Warburton. Ryan Finesse, 28 from Salisbury. This is Mike Warburton, 37 from Wrexham, a former World Masters semi-finalist. Confirmation of the win there for Peter Jakes, keeping himself in the mix. They've all played one match, so this is the start. First of leg will be Mike to throw cycle first. Cycle game number on. two. Remember, all the players have five matches in total to play today. So they all have four to go. Sixty. A possible eight points up for grabs. 97. Both these players losing their opening matches of the day. Ryan Furness played very well against Kieran Tian, who was absolutely outstanding. 140. We'll Kieran Tian next up against Peter Jakes. Ryan averaged 99.65. Whilst Graham Usher took care 140. of the ball. 140. 4-1 with an 87 average, two 180s, and 50% on the doubles. 60. Ryan Finesse won this tie yesterday 4 3. 94. Is the 1 to 2 favourite to win this one. Finesse 6 to 4. 140. Ryan, you require 170. One hundred. Make you require one hundred and one. Fifty-seven. Oh, he's just missed it. Would have left double twelve. Sixty-nine. Thirty-two. Ryan, you require seventy. For an S. Knock this seventy about. I'm going to break a throw in leg one. Double sixteen. Fifty-four. No, sir. Make you require thirty-two. 1st leg, Mike Warburton. Warby holds it all together for a 17 dart hold in leg one. 2nd leg, Ryan to throw first. 95. 100. One hundred. One hundred. Eighty-five. Just drops the dart. Not thrown, so of course can pick it up, regroup, and try and find one hundred and forty. Slots it in the trouble twenty. Takes him down to one six one. So there's a bit of pressure on the Frenes throw. Lovely second dart. 97. Could have been worse. Mike, you require 161. Could have found the three. Could have found the single 17 to leave 1, 2, 4. Of course, that's a combination that requires either the treble 20 or the treble 18. Ryan, you require 124. So now he needs the treble 18 and ball. 41. Mike, you require 71. 39 for 32 or 51 for double 10. 14 now leaves tops for 2-0. 31. Ryan, you require 83. 51 leaves.
James, 32. James shot in the second leg. Finish. Ryan Furness. A lovely double 16 after finding the 51. Put one on the outside. Just squeezed that Third final Third leg, Mike in. to throw first. Two holds a throw, one apiece. 43. 180. That's the first of the match. And it goes... 140. To Ryan Furness. Ninety-five to move move towards the numbers he achieved in match number one, where he ended with a ninety-nine average. One hundred and forty. One hundred and forty. Sixty. Ryan, you require eighty six. Game shot in the third leg. Ryan Furness. And Ryan Furness absolutely nailing the double sixteen for the eighty six finish. So fourth leg an Ryan to three throw finish first. is followed by an eighty six finish. Furness. 100. A 2 at 1 lead, and that was an 11 darter. That's his best of this group so far. 60. He had two 14 darters yesterday, but an 11 is a PB for the week so far. 58. Eighty-five. Forty-three. One hundred and forty. One hundred. One hundred. One hundred and forty. Mike, you require one hundred and sixteen. That's the go. Looking like 3 1 the way Furness has been finishing. Double 18. Game oh, shot in the ball what a leg. Wonderful Mike finish. Warburton. That was from Warby. And of course, it is the break back. Fifth leg, it's Mike to throw first. Looking like Furness was going to take a 3 1 lead. 100. 100. 60. 140. Ryan, you require 170. One of them. 
134. Super 54 to lead 36 after 12. We're going to get three consecutive breaks of throw. 95. In three high quality legs uh, and 11. Ryan, you require 36. From Ryan. And then a 15 with the 116. Game shot in the fifth leg. Ryan Furness. 14 from Ryan Furness. He leads 3-2 and has the darts to get it done in leg six. Six leg. It's Ryan to throw first. Well, Ryan Furness, as in match one, is averaging 99. 99.65 is end average in ma match one. He's averaging 99.83. Ninety-three. Ton. We're leaving one six one. One hundred and forty. One hundred. Depends if Furness hits from here. Oh, that's a great second dart. One hundred. Mike require one hundred and sixty-one. Easier finish. Ninety-nine. One six from Warby. Ryan, you require one hundred and twelve. Can we get a one one two for the match? He wants tops to do it. Ninety-two. Make you require sixty-two. Got a ten. 12 for tops or 20 double 16 it's 12 for tops 42 that may be Ryan you require 20 all she wrote 15 four match starts make you require Furness. 20 he's left himself five Game shot in the sixth leg. Mike Warburton. Is a fourth consecutive breaker throw. A 16 darter for Warby, but four match darts for Ryan Furness would have Seventh ended and final with an leg. average Mike two of 100. Now he has to go through it all again and try and get the breaker throw to win it. Eighty-one. Sixty. 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 One hundred. Twenty one points in front now, all week. Ninety three. One hundred and forty. One hundred and twenty left with the throw after twelve darts. Seventy-nine. And time. Make you require one hundred and twenty. Forty. Well, that 
makes the leg a little more interesting. Ninety-seven certainly does now. Make your require doable. eighty. One twelve, and he missed the one twelve, of course, in leg six to win it. And then went on to miss a further three darts, and Warby has missed the big 40. twenty. So, Ryan, Ryan you require one hundred and twelve. One hundred and twelve. Another twenty double sixteen. One hundred. Make you require forty. Twenty. Ryan, you require twelve. A reprieve for Ryan. Double three. Nine. Oh dear. Make you require Seven. twenty. Match darts now in total for Ryan Finesse. Game shot in the match. Mike Warburton. And Warby has dodged one there. His final dart, a twenty four darter to win it. Seven match darts in total for Ryan Finesse. Four in leg six, three in that deciding leg. Three out of 13 on the doubles for Ryan, four out of 12 for Warby. But it is Warby who picks up his first two points of the day. When we come back, it's Kieran Tehan against Peter Jakes. <laughs>
morning and um, welcome back to the online darts live league for match number five as Kieran Tehan takes on Peter Jakes. So here's Peter Jakes, 49 from Denby Dale, West Yorkshire. This man part of Ireland down there in Cork should I say across there Morby with that win moves on to six points first leg it's Kieran, Kieran to first two in front game of him on. on eight and a win here for Peter Jakes and he will join Kieran Tian on eight points 57. Kieran won this tie yesterday. It was a it was a tight one, winning 4-3 with an 88-59. Peter Jakes, 91.22, hit 3-180. 10 darts at a double. Eighty-three. Ninety-six. One hundred. One hundred and thirty-four. One hundred and twenty. Ninety nine. Hearing you require one hundred and forty one. First dibs with the throw goes to T Hunt. Sixty. Peter, you require 144. Another one of those leaves double 12. 132. Right on Kieran, you require 81. Kieran, still a bit to do on the 81. He was very good on his finishing against Ryan Finesse. He wants double 13. Game and shot at the first leg. Kieran Tian. The one dart on the wire, a double 12 for a break, a throw in leg one for Peter Jakes. And it is an 18 dart. Second hold. leg, it's Peter to throw first. With an 81 checkout for T Hunt. One hundred. Eighty-five. Eighty-one. One hundred and thirty-four. Six of the day to follow is table topping. One hundred and twenty-five. The late Scott Walters will be looking to right the wrongs from that match against Peter Jakes. Eighty. Ninety-five. Sixty. Peter, you require one hundred. Seventy. 
60. He'll be back at tops. Hearing you require 142. Can. He'll take out 142. It's quite a complicated finish. Oh, he's going down for 6 17s and tops. A84. PT require 40. Game shot in the second leg. Peter Jakes. And Peter Jakes gets there in the end for the hole to throw. And we have a level match. Not really. Third leg. Kieran to throw first. Not going yet, this one. Forty-five. Averages reflecting that. Eighteen dart. Eighteen dart hold in leg one. One hundred and thirty-four. And an eighteen dart hold in leg two for Peter. Eighty-one. Forty four ninety nine sixty. Ninety-six. Peter has to be careful here. Straight turn. He's moving a bogey number. And he Fifty-seven. The level eighteen to leave one seventy. So six starts at Tihan if he needs them at one eighty. Level one forty to leave tops, of course, and that's exactly what he's going to get. One hundred and forty. One hundred and forty. Kieran, you require forty. Game shot in the third leg. And Kieran Tien finds the double ten. This time it's a seventeen dart hold of throw for a two one lead. Fourth leg, Peter to throw first. Forty three. No one eight is in the match yet. Remember one hundred and thirty one. Peter Jakes looking to make it nineteen consecutive matches with at least one one eighty in it. One hundred. By him, that is, of course. At least one one eighty in his last ninety five live league matches. Mario Musher is up to thirteen. Thirty. Fifty nine. Players unable to replicate the performances shown in 60. their opening matches. Tian averaged 106.24 against Furness. He's averaging 87.97 here. Peter Jakes averaged 91.15 against Scott Walters. He's averaging 83.69. The break of throw is definitely on. Sixty. Kieran, you require seventy six. No real 
of damage as Peter Jakes is back on 208. 44. Peter Jakes. 100. Performs at a Kieran, you much, much higher level than this. Twenty-four. Peter, you require one hundred and eight. Seventy-six. Kieran, you require eight. Game shot in the fourth leg. Kieran Tien. Kieran Tien eventually gets the break of throw. The first of this match leads 3-1. Has the darts to win it 4-1. Fifth leg, it's Kieran to throw first. Disappointing performance so far from Peter Jakes. He will be really frustrated with this one so far. 96. You're never out of it when your opponent's averaging... Just 85. He doesn't have to raise his game massively. 60. To get back in this one. But the frustration is evident. 60. One hundred. One hundred and forty. Sixty. One hundred and sixty-five. Beautiful approach play from Kieran Tihan. Ending the trouble fifteen. To leave tops after twelve. And that should be just about it. Forty-five. Kieran, you require forty. Game shot in the match. Kieran Tian. Is just about it. A disappointing showing there from Peter Jakes. That will leave him seriously frustrated. 79.96 the average. Tidy enough from Kieran Tian. Wasn't pushed. 88.45. 4-1 in the 140 column. And that's the first match in 19. But Peter Jakes hasn't hit a 180. In fact, he just hit that 1-140. A bizarre showing. Up next, it's Graham Usher against Scott Walters.
to the online darts live league live on Sporty Stuff TV. Up next, match number six, and it's Graham Usher against Scott Walters. Hello, Scott. 39 from Winchester. Up against 48-year-old Graham Usher from Scarborough. Information of the win for Kieran Tihan, and he joins Usher on 10 points, maybe only briefly, of course, if Usher can get the win here. First leg, it's Graham to throw he first. The win, Game comfortably on. enough, yesterday against Walters, winning 4-1. 45. He's 8-13 to 13 to replicate that today. 6-5 to five about Walters. 60. 121. Peter Jakes hasn't got too long to dwell on that disappointing performance against Tihan. He is 41. Up next against Mike Warburton. 140. 100. 99. 100. Graham, you require 96. 78. 40. Graham, you require 18. 18. Game shot in the first leg. Graham Usher. Graham Usher eventually finding the double and putting the leg away. Comfortable hold of throw. This is their Second third is meeting in the live league. They previously met in the qualification. 174. Week four in phase three. 100. Phase three, week two in a semi-final. And it was Usher who won 4-0 with an 87 16. average. And then, of course, it was Walters who won the third and fourth place playoff. 100. Defeating Kai Fan Lung. 85. Forget we have a week break next week and then we 98. return with phase four. What a lineup that is. I'll give you the details on that tomorrow night. 60. During finals night. 139. Scott, you require 122. Bullseye. A 97. Graham, you've had 64. 32. Scott, you require 25. Double eight for a level game. Double four. 21. Graham, you require 32. 24. Scott, you require 4. For a 2 0 lead. Game shot in the second leg. Scott so Walters. Finds double 2 to get a 19 dart hold, but 4 darts 
at a double there for Graham Usher for 2-0. Third leg, Graham throwing first. Forty. One hundred and thirty seven. Seventy eight. Piece and very little in the averages. One hundred. Players slow out of the gate in this one. Ninety-six. One hundred and forty. One hundred. Scott, you require one hundred and twenty four. Forty. Fifty six. Scott, you require eighty four. Break a throw and a two on lead. Has to go for it. And Game gets shot it. in the third leg. A beautiful Scott bullseye Walters. for Scott Walters. There is a beautiful shot of a beautiful shot. Fourth leg, Scott throwing first. He wasn't dead in the middle. Wasn't far off though, was it? One hundred and thirty-four. Leg of the match, a fifteen darter for Walters. One hundred and eighty. So Graham Usher now makes it fourteen matches with at 40. least hitting one one eighty. Fifty-eight. One hundred and eighty. Didn't hit one yesterday. He's hit two now today. Eighty-three. Scott, you require one hundred and forty-seven. Got six starts at this. No finish for Usher. Total 17 is the shot. 97. Oh, my apologies. The 12 or 20 wasn't in. It looked it. 60. Scott, you require 50. Tops for 3 1. Double 10. Game shot in the fourth leg, Scott Walters. Back to back legs for Scott Walters, both one in fifth, well actually it's three on the spin, he lost the opening leg. One leg, two in 19, fifth leg, four and five have both come in 15 darts. 140. 84 60 59 81 
100. Shit, looking good to peg one back. One hundred and forty. Graham, you require one hundred and twenty. Starts at one twenty. Gonna need them. Twenty-four. Oh dear. Sixty. Graham, you require ninety-six. Eighty. Oh, Scott, you require 130. We see another bullseye for Walters. Single 20 leaves the ball. Can he find it again? 86. <coughs> Graham, you require 16. The weight was spot on. The dart was Game east shot in the fifth of leg. the target. Graham Usher. And as Graham Usher holds in 20 darts, but it is Walters with the honour in leg six. Six legs, Scott two, throw first. One hundred. Well, Walters has had one match dart. One hundred and forty. One hundred and eighty. Two in the match. Fifty-eight. One hundred and forty. One hundred and seventy one. Scott, you require eighty one. To win it in some style. Twelve and bull. Can he hit it this time? Yes, Game. he can. Shot. And the match. Scott and Walters. Wins the match with a twelve dart hold a throw and an eighty one finish on the ball. He missed the ball for the one thirty to win it full one all together to take out his second 81 finish on the ball. An end average of 89.43, 218 is 4140 is four out of nine on the doubles. And Scott Walters picks up his first win of the day. Up next, it is Ke uh, Peter Jakes against Mike Warburton.
Welcome back to the Online Darts Live League for match number 7 of 15. And it is Peter Jakes against Mike Wolverton. Peter Jakes from West Yorkshire, Denby Dale. Up against Mike Wolverton from Wrexham. That is three players on six points. All the players have three to play, so there's only six points available. First leg, it's Peter to throw first, game on. Whoever loses this one, it's pretty much over for them. Isn't mathematically 140. Kieran Tian and Graham Usher looking reasonably good form. Tian has to play Walters. 180. And, and Mike Warburton. As Warby finds a max. 59. Usher has. Ryan Furness up next. Then Kieran Tehan. And then Peter Jakes. Could well have a Six. twist in its tail, but for me, it's unlikely that Graham or Kieran. 54. Don't end up one and two. It will take a bit of a monumental collapse, that's for sure. Peter was the four to six favourite for this match. Mike, 11 to 10. 100. 100. And this is where it all started to go wrong for Warby yesterday. He started the day with 101.96 and a 4-1 win Mike, against you require Kieran 161. Tehan. Then back that up with a 4-2 win over Walters with 104.96. And then lost 4-1 to Peter Jakes, who averaged... 100.91 with three one eighty And that started a run of three defeats for Warby. He lost that one, of course, as I said, 4 1. Then went 100. down 4 3 to Finesse. Make you require 102. Then went down 4 2 to Graham Usher. It has to be said, the only one he wasn't. Well, in fact, how do I say poor? 70. Against Furness, Peter, you require 108. And averaged 81, 4 3. That was his only average under 90. And will be averaged 76. 93, 24 Mike, for the 32. day. Game shot in the first leg. Mike Warburton. He's a 16 dart breaker throw. In leg one, is Warby about to start to make his move? Second leg, it's Mike to throw first. One hundred. The seven, seventh meeting between the two. 59. So fifth meeting in the live league. Peter Jakes has won them all. The two away from the live league. Peter Jakes beat. 100. Warby 6-4 at 
this year's Q School in Stage 2. And played in the last 41. 64 of Challenge Tour 10 this year with Peter Jakes winning 5-2. One hundred and forty. Maybe today's the day he gets his first win against Peter Jakes. Thirty-six. Make you require one hundred and sixteen. Sixty. One hundred and eighty. Make you require fifty six. Thirty six. Peter, you require one hundred and twenty seven. Peter back in the one eighties, didn't hit one last time out. One hundred and two in a while. He's missed the ball there. Make you require twenty. For a level game, will be double four. Twelve. Clippity clip. Peter, Warburton. you require twenty-five. No score. Make you require eight. No score. Peter, you require twenty five. Strange end to the leg. A lot of pressure on it, of course. Game shot in the second leg. Peter Jakes. <laughs> Peter Jakes gets the right back. A 24 darter. What a chance that was for Warby to go 2-0 up. Third leg. Peter throwing first. One hundred and forty. Jake, sir. French name, of course. One hundred and forty. Actually, the French equivalent of the name James. One hundred. One hundred and forty. One hundred. Mm, those of you that are interested in Latin, you'll probably know it's Jacobus. Fifty-eight. Peter, you require 161. Latin name for James, which ended up Jake's. 97. Course. 97. Peter, you require 64. Back to back legs. There's the 48. Wants double eight. Hit it last time. Hits Game it this shot time. The third leg. Peter oh, Jakes. That's a much better leg. Nine darts less than leg two. A 15 dart hold after the break back. 2 1. Fourth leg. Mike to throw first. 
60. One hundred and forty. One hundred. One hundred and eighty. Second in the match for Peter. Making up for not hitting one last time out. Eighty five. One hundred and five. How costly will that performance by Peter Jakes against Kieran T. One hundred and eighty. Peter, you require seventy six. Both on seventy six. And it is Peter Jakes who gets first go at the tops. Fifty six. This is for a twelve darter. Mike, you require seventy six. Be. It's a good marker. And Game shot in the fourth leg. Mike Warburton. <laughs> 15 darter. Two 180s in the leg. One apiece. One dart at tops. The 3 1 for Peter. And we have a level game. Fifth leg. Peter 2. Throw first. And it is the averages currently. 134. 140. an untidy match if you take 140. out that second leg that ended up at 24 darts with both players missing multiple darts at doubles the doubling stats at the moment two 121 Peter, two from 12 for Warby 16 missed darts at doubles between them and both playing to an average of 188 has hit 11 scores of a ton or more 100 5 between a ton and 139 4 140s and 2 180s Peter Jakes 8 scores of between a ton and 139 3 140s and 2 180s 100 Peter you require 146 is on 12 scores of a ton or more. 86. Peter Jakes is on 13. Make you require 161. 44. Peter, you require 60. Game shot in the fifth leg. Peter Jakes. Peter Jakes chips in with his second 15 darter of the match. Six leg. Might to throw first. 11 legs for Warby. 16 and 15. Peter, 24, 15 and 15. 121. Ninety-nine. One hundred. Strong 
Back from Warby to keep the game alive. Into 140 after nine. 58. Make you require 140. Forty two the trouble twenty could make things interesting and he's found it. Make you require ninety eight to a very doable one oh four if Warby can't take out ninety eight, he needs trouble eighteen. Trouble twelve. That's Game shot in the sixth leg. Mike Warburton. It is another 15 darter. The last four legs have all been won in holds a throw and all been won in seventh and final darts. leg. It's Peter throwing first. 140. Sixty. One hundred and forty. One hundred. One hundred. One hundred and forty. Peter, you require one hundred and twenty-one. Pretty sure, guaranteeing in that opening match of this se session produced our five hundredth, hundred plus average. I'll double check that with my man in the know. One hundred. So Peter Jakes, sixty-four Peter points away. Sixty-four. From a much needed four-three win, double eight. Game shot in the match. Peter Jakes. Well, the final five legs of that match were of the highest quality. Four 15 darters and a 14 darter from Peter Jakes to win it 4 3. Averages 91.39 for Peter Jakes. Remember, they were down in the 70s, late 70s, after the second leg. 90.99 for Warby. 4 180s in the match, 2 apiece. 12 140s in the match, 6 apiece. But it was Peter Jakes with the slightly better finishing. 4 out of 11, 36, 36%. Right up next, it is Ryan Furness against Graham Usher.
Good morning and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League for match number 8 of 15 and it's Ryan Furness against Graham Usher. Just to confirm that opening match this morning between Kieran Tihan and Ryan Furness. Kieran Tihan averaging 106.24 was our 500. 100 plus average here at the live league. Confirmation of the t of the table and the win for Peter Jakes. He does go on to eight first points. First leg, it's Ryan to throw first. Game on. But Graham Usher has this game in hand. As will Kieran Tihan, sixty, who is up next against Scott Walters. 100. Eighty five. Sixty. Kieran Tian, the only unbeaten player so far today. One hundred. One hundred and eighty. This man's one eighty run continues. Peter Jakes went eighteen matches. One hundred consecutive matches where he hit. Graham, you require one hundred and sixty one. Graham Usher is now up to fifteen consecutive matches. Fifty seven. Ryan, you require one hundred and fifty six. 116. Graham, you require 104. Number six to leave at tops. I think we're still counting them, counting them up as well. 88. Leaves double eight, just in case. Ryan, you require 40. Looking for a hold of throw in leg one. Ryan Furness. Game shot in the first tops, leg. Ryan Furness. Tops and it is a 16 dart hold. To get this one underway. Good approach play, the 116 to leave the tops. Second there, Graham to throw first. 41. 140. 100. Referee there, Andy Walsh, stepped in for the last couple of days. Ryan Binks back on the mic this evening. 119. Champions Week final. 140. 41. 121. He's deflected into the wall there with his final dart to leave 99. 43. Not too much. Graham, you require done. 99. 42 left. Number 16. 83. Ryan, you require 158. So Graham Usher will be back. It was a 16 darter in leg one. 38. Ryan Furness. Graham, you require 16. 16. Game shot in the second leg. Graham Usher. So 18 darter, but more importantly, a hold of throw for Graham Usher. One apiece. Third leg, Ryan to throw first. Graham Usher won this tie yesterday, 4-2. So 
scored so well in the match. He averaged 103.45 with 10 missed starts at doubles. Furness averaged 140. At the moment, as you can see, 90.18 for Ness, 93.83 for Usher. One hundred. Twenty-six. This is where Usher makes his move. Eighty-three. I thought he was brave staying there. It didn't look attractive from my angle. 130. It's a great visit to me. 105. 85. Ryan, you require 105. Tops, tops. 85. Graham, you require 93. Trouble 18 for double 16. 45. 48. Ryan, you if require he gets 20. A go. Game shot in the third leg. Ryan Finesse. Yeah, two holds are thrown out for Ryan Finesse. One in 16 and 17 darts. Was a chance again for Usher. Fourth leg. Graham throwing first. 59. Walters, 90 here in Teham to follow this one. 96. We'll have seen one of the players completing three matches apiece, so all will have two to play after that. 95. One. 99. 100. The win here for Graham Usher, of course, and he's pretty much. 57. Well, he's got one foot in the final, at least. Nathan Gervin already there. 97. Winner of Group A. 81. Trouble here. Ryan, you Usher. require 116. 60. Graham, you require 109. He's got to go. 90 left. Out of all tops. 47. Ryan, you require 56. Two darts in hand. Needing the ball for a double. Don't like that shot. It's the smallest target on the board. Forty six. Graham you require sixty two. Fifty six. Tops. Game shot in the fourth leg. Graham oh, Usher. He's got away with one there in the end. It is a fourth consecutive holder throw in the match. Fifth leg, it's Ryan to throw first. And then a little between them. 137. I just feel that this one's going to come down to who makes the fewer mistakes. 100. 97. For when we return a week on Tuesday, we'll include a player 83. on debut who will be in action in the World Seniors. In fact, we've got a couple of players involved in the World Seniors. More about that lineup tomorrow night. Join tomorrow night's final of.
these three 140. Champions Six starts for finesse to make out 167. 100. Seriously important final dart. 138. Ryan, you go, 67. Usher ready to pounce on tops. Double 16, one in hand. 35. Graham, you require 40. Game shot in the fifth leg. Graham the best Usher. leg of the match is our first break of throw in the match, and it's Graham Usher with a 13 darter. Leads 3 2. Has the darts to serve this one out in the sixth. Sixth leg. Graham to throw first. 140. 120. 140. A bit of a spring in his step after that 13 dart break of throw, and rightly so. 59. Back to back 140s. 140. 140s thrice. 81 after 9. 31. Graham, you require 81. Total 12. Double 6. 69. 140. Graham, you require 12. Game, shot, and, and a match. Back to back. Graham Usher. 13 dart legs for Graham Usher. Sees him over the line from 2-2. Two, two. Ends with an average of 92, 91, 86, 87 for Furness. Twice as many 140s in the match for Graham Usher. 6-3 and 4 out of 9 on the doubles. And he moves to 12 points when we come back. It is Scott Walters against Kieran Tian.
Welcome back to the Online Darts Live League. Up next, it is match number 9 of 15, and it's Scott Walters against Kieran Tiam. Win there for Graham Usher. Puts him on to 12 points. the final match of the third cycle of games and after this there is only four points available so a win for Tian here and will be Walters and Furness are out of the equation mathematically leg, Scott throwing first game on of course could reach 12 points but Either Tihan or one hundred and twenty. Both of their remaining matches. Sixty. Could well have a twist, especially if Walters can get the win here. One hundred and forty. Followed by a one forty. Forty one. One hundred and forty. Followed by another one forty. One oh one after nine. Fifty-seven. Scott, you require one hundred and one. Of course, with three wins, could reach twelve points. Game shot in the first leg. Scott Walters. And if he continues like that, he will reach twelve points. A hold of throw in twelve. A one hundred and one checkout. Second leg. It's Kieran to throw first. Ninety-five. Kieran lost this tie to Scott Walters yesterday, four-one. Scott averaged ninety point nine one in that one, had a high finish of ninety-nine. One two one. Ninety-three. Yeah, being on the cusp of qualifying brings its own pressure. A bit of winning line wobbles. 62. 96. 134. 140. 60. Kieran, you require 77. 77. Game shot in the second leg. Great Kieran Tien. There's a 12 darter from Scott in leg one, and that's a 14 dart hold in leg two from Kieran Tian. Third leg, Scott throwing Taking first. out the 77. There's a player missing a dart, a double. 58. Each of those combinations, the 101 from Walters, and the 77 in two from Kieran Tian. 
137. One hundred and forty. Our averages on those. Now we're going to get our five hundred and first. Ninety nine. Hundred plus average. Seventy six. Kieran, you require 130. Good luck today as Charlie Corstefin, our regular referee here at the Online Darts Live League, makes his PDC European Tour debut. 98. And his Scott, you require 144. Well, it's just about to start. Big Boris Kutchmeyer against another Irishman, Steve Lennon. Eighty-four. Like I said, I'll keep you up to speed. Kieran, you require happens. thirty-two. So back to Game back. shot in the third leg. Dark Kieran legs. Tien. And Kieran Tien finds the double sixteen. Leg two was a fourteen dart hold. Leg three, a fourteen dart break. Two one to the Irishman. Fourth leg. It's Kieran two. Throw first. Forty-three. Thirty. Jacques Muller, the MC over there in Zwolle in the Netherlands. Looks like he's rocking a bit of Claudio Luigi. One hundred and forty. Wonder where he's got that idea from. Comes Walters. 180. This is fourth 180 of the day. My apologies, a third. Yeah, it is a fourth. Didn't hit one yesterday. 140. Kieran Tihan responds with a 140. 83. Forty-five. Only forty-five, so a chance for Walters. One hundred. Minimum requirement. Kieran, now. you require one hundred and thirty-three. Ninety-three. Scott, you require one hundred and eight for the break back. Thirty-eight. Tops for Tihan for three-one. Kieran, you require forty. Game shot in the fourth leg. Kieran Tian. It's a 17 dart hold, and Kieran Tian does make it three on the spin. Lost the opening leg. Won the next three. Fifth leg, Scott to throw first. 100. Eighty-three. 
140. One hundred and thirty four. Fifty seven. One hundred. One hundred. Eighty one. Scott, you require one hundred and four. Eighty four. So one oh three. Four Kieran, you require 103. Win it. 4 1. 48 36. Don't mind that because the adjustment is a much smaller one. 53. There's Walters at double 10. Scott, you require 20. To go within just one leg of leveling the match up. Game he shot in the fifth it. leg, Scott Walters. Those players winning the last two legs in 17 darts, both holds. So it is Tihan with the darts to win it 4 2. Sixth leg, Kieran to throw first. <laughs> 140. Ninety nine, eighty two, fifty eight. Dutch Darts Masters in Zwolle. 51. Irishman Steve Lennon leads Croatian Bar Scritchmeyer by two legs to one. Another Irishman leads here in Kieran Tiha. 100. 3 2. And closing in on a 4 2 win. 100. 100. Kieran, you require 128. 63. Scott, you require 144. 65 for Kieran. 60. To wrap this one up. Kieran, you require 65. 60. Typical. Double four. Game shot and a match. And Kieran Tien. Pins it for an 18 dart hold. Winning legs 14, 14, 17 and 18 darts. An average of 90.1. The higher average for Walters, 92.3. 818, uh, 8140s, I wish there was 8180s, 8140s for a piece. Checkout percentage from both, very, very high. Right, when we come back, it will be Ryan Furness against Peter Jakes. <laughs>
Good afternoon and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League. Up next, match number 10 as Ryan Finesse takes on Peter Jakes. Ryan, even money for this one. Peter Jakes, a backable 8 to 11. Peter won this tie 4 1 yesterday. And he will know it is. Must win game if he stands any chance of catching either Usher or Tihan. It is unlikely all the same, but I suppose you never know. And if he does win, he's got to win big. First leg, it's Ryan throwing yeah, first. Could work either game way on. for Ryan, of course. He can play with absolute carefree and... 29. Enjoy the match with no pressure. He know he, he knows his race is run. The only player under a bit of pressure to win is 44. this man. Some players, of course, when they're not under the cosh. 100. Tend to play with freedom. So many individual sports when 100 the pressure is off. Fifty nine. Some players, of course, do need a bit of pressure to keep them sharp. Forty three. Moves from. Euro Tour. Steve Lennon just got his nose in front full three against Boris Kritschmeyer. 41. One hundred and thirty five. One hundred and forty. Ryan, you require one hundred and thirty seven. He did the trouble to start the combination. But Peter Jakes will be back at eighty. Peter, you require eighty. Tops. 60. Ryan, you require 78. If anything been lacking, it's just those clutch finishes and pinning the doubles. Tops for Ryan. 58. Same hole. Peter, you require 20. Game shot in the first leg. Peter Jakes. Peter Jakes breaks throw in leg one with 19 darts. Not before, of course, Furness had one dart. Tops on 78. Second leg, Peter throwing first. <laughs> 89. 84.9 with two 180s and eight missed darts at doubles against Furness yesterday. He had an average of 90.4. 180. <laughs> and hit one out of six on his doubles. 100. 80 of the match goes to Peter Jakes. 84. He's now hit one ton, 1140 and 1180. 98. Peter, you require 148. 43. Just do not understand it the switch there anyway. May as well have gone for 18s. 
60. Peter, you require 105. Seventy-three. Tidied up in the end. Ryan, you require one hundred and sixty. One hundred. Peter, you require thirty-two. Game shot in the second leg. Peter Jakes. And Peter getting there in the end with a hold after breaking in leg one. Third leg, it's Ryan throwing first. 18 darts. Sorry, 19 darts followed by 16 darts for... 100. Peter Jakes. 35 darts. Give him two legs. He needs an 85, 89. 177. in leg two, a 177 42. in leg three, still on the possibility of a nine, of course, starting with a 177. 140. 99. 140. Gives a lovely leg from Peter Jakes. 177. That's 41. 55. 40. Peter, you require 44. Double 16 for an 11 darter. 12. 105. Peter, you require 32. 102. No score. Ryan, you require 100. 90. Oh, for a mess. A great effort. Peter, you require 32. Missed darts at a double here for 3 0 for Peter Jakes. He's just not attacking the double. Flapping. 24. Ryan, you require 10. 10. Game shot in the third leg. Ryan for Ness. Finesse, despite Peter Jakes leaving 44 after 9. Eight darts at a double, lost the leg. Fourth leg, Peter throwing first. 180. 180. Number 2. And the 177. One hundred of the one eighty sandwich. One eighty in leg two, one seven seven leg three, one eighty leg four. One hundred. Boris Kretschmar with an unbelievable win against Steve. One hundred and thirty four. Steve Lennon wired double sixteen for a one three one to win it six four. 140. 100. 180. Peter, you require 81. Turn 140. He's scoring phase in this fourth leg. Double 13. 55. Ryan, you require 167. Got it. Bull. One hundred and forty-two. 
Peter, you require 26. Game shot in the fourth leg. Peter Jakes. He will be relieved. He left it to the final dart. A 15 darter to hold after Furness has missed the ball for 167 for 2 2. Fifth leg it will be Ryan 2 for the first. A little spell there where Peter Jakes couldn't finish his dinner. This match 60. should be done and dusted. Full zip. The average for Peter J. 140. And he's just 3 from 15 on the doubles. He's missed 12 darts at a double almost. Well, it is a, a leg of darts. 100. One hundred. Above ninety. One hundred and forty. Furness isn't going away. Only playing for pride at this stage. Sixty. One hundred and thirty nine. One hundred and five. Ryan, you require sixty two. Forty four. Tops for three two. And a Game fifteen daughter of his own. Leg. Ryan sales. And Furness now within one, but it is Peter with the throw. Should close it out here. Six leg, Peter to throw first. Ryan Furness makes it just 60. Two one forties in the match. Six for Peter Jakes. No one eighties. Two for Peter. 60. And of course, Peter has had a. One seven seven for the big scores have gone to Peter Jakes. Fifty four. The doubling has been a disaster. One hundred and thirty four. Eighty three. All stems from that leg three. One hundred and thirty five. Peter Jakes was on forty four after nine. And Ryan Furness eventually won the leg in twenty. One hundred and forty. Sixty. Peter, you require one hundred and sixty four. One hundred and four. Ryan, you require one hundred and twelve. By Peter Jakes. But it is Furness who's going to get a dart at tops for a level game. Ninety two. Peter, you require sixty. Hit a double. Game Probably shot in the match. This time Peter Jakes. For the match. And Peter Jakes get it, gets it done with a 17 darter and a 4 2 win. He goes on to 10 points plus 4. Now 2 behind the top 2 in Graham Usher and Kieran Tian. Averages very, very similar 89 75, 88 1 9. But the big scores were for Peter Jakes. But look at the finishing. 12 missed at a double, 4 from 16.
When we come back, it is Mike Warburton against Scott Walters. Good afternoon and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League for match number 11 and it's Mike Warburton against Scott Walters. Confirmation of the win there for Peter Jakes. He has one more to play. The other two above him have two more to play. So Peter Jakes can get to 12. Just depends on what those do above him. First leg, mate to throw first, game it's on. All over for these two. So just playing for pride. Four to five, Warby. Walters 140. 10 to 11. Warby was fabulous. And well, this was the match of the day yesterday. Warby winning 2 with 104.96. Scott Walters, 101.39, 50% on his doubles. Warby, 66% on his doubles. 1180 and a high finish at 71. It was 100. an absolute cracker. 100. One hundred. After those over 
interesting. Two matches from more 140. Yesterday. Make you require and 161. To beat in this group. And it all went a little bit Pete Tong. Nine matches he lost. Scott, you require 161. Didn't play badly at all. Averaged 88.04 in one, 96 in another. 97. Lost for Make one require and 71. Level 10 for a 14 dart hold. Game shot in the first leg. Mate Warburton. And a totally different mindset here. Second leg, Scott to throw first. Sixty. One hundred and forty. A bright start to this one from Warby. 83. 100. 45 by a ton. So he's wrestled the darts off Walters here. Walters. 140. 140 of his own. 57. One hundred and thirty-two. Superb back-to-back -back visits from Walters. One forty and one three-two down to eighty-six after twelve. There's the opportunity of a fourteen darter of his own. Trouble eighteen for double sixteen. Sixty. <coughs> eighteen. Scott, 18 you ball. require eighty-six. He's got fifty-four. Seventy. Make you require 144. 60. Scott, you require 16. Game shot in the second leg. Scott Walters. That's a 16 dart reply for Scott Walters to level this one up at one apiece. Two holds a throw. Third leg, Mike to throw first. Yep, the two on top of the table. Both on the 12 96. points. Lock horns in our next match. Graham Usher against Kieran Tehan. Sixty. That much, of course, guaranteed. Fifty-eight to be in tomorrow night's final. One hundred. One hundred. Eighty-five. One hundred. 
64. Make you require 147. Forty one. Sixty four. Make you require one hundred and six. 17, no, 74 left, interesting, he goes 42, 46. 32, Scott, you require 128, no, 71, we'll go 51, double 10, Ball. oh, oh, nails it, third leg. Scott, Scott Walters. Walters, with another ball finish, this time a 1, 2, 8, had finishes of 84 and 81, on the ball, last time out. Fourth leg will be Scott to throw first. Not last time, the one before that, my apologies. In his match against Graham Usher. 11. One hundred. Eighty three. One hundred and eighty. To respond, one hundred and nineteen. Four, I think it was still a healthy lead to break back. One hundred. One hundred. Make you require one hundred and twenty one. Ninety six. Oh, just missing the ball. I think there's still a wire away. One hundred and forty. Make you waters. require twenty five. Game shot the fourth leg. Mike Warburton. Warby does get the break back. A 15 dart break of throw. Talking of break fifth of leg throws, Ryan Mike Meikles just Roper. taking out 164 to go 2 0 up on Andy Bolton. Over there in Holland in the Jack's Dutch Darts Masters. Day one. 45. Ninety four. Waters ahead in the averages, but we have a level game. One hundred and forty. Sixty. Sixty. Ninety-six. Can we 
squeeze in. 100. Second half or 12, 20. A ton takes him down to 156. Not just that needs to travel now. 60. Doesn't get one. So Make you require 156. Two visits if he needs them. Or 156. There's one treble 20. He needs another. 100. Ninety-nine. Make you require fifty-six. Sixteen for tops. And again, this is the big number. Thirty-two. Twenty-four. Scott, you require ninety-two. Number seventeen. 28. Make you require 32. Game shot in the fifth leg. Mike Warburton. Wins it this time for a 19 dart hold after the break back. Leads 3 2. Waters now has to win the next two legs. Six legs. Scott to throw first. 140. Well 100. Showing wonderful integrity here. Both out of it, of course. Neither can qualify now for tomorrow night's final. 100. Both still trying at their absolute best. Sixty. Fifty-seven. Sixty. 83. 140. Scott, you require 121. 43. This is the trouble. So 141 for Might Warby. you require 141. Well, the one's got to come off at some point. 41. Scott, you require 78. Fifty-eight. Make you require one hundred. The trouble twenty. You may see tops tops depending on the light. Game shot in the match. Mike Warburton. Beautiful way to finish the match. Wins it four two with the hundred finish. Sixty and tops in two. There we go. 87.61 for Warby, 86.91 for Waters, only 1.180 in the match going to Warby, 4.140 is a piece, good finishing, 4 out of 6, 66.67. Well up next, it's a big one, it's the table topping Graham Usher against the player who's just behind him on leg difference, Kieran Tehan.
afternoon and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League for match number 12 of 15. And it's the final game in the fourth cycle of Magison, the biggest game of the day. As Graham Usher faces Kieran Tihan. Confirmation of the win for Wolvie. He has one more to play. These two have two more to play. Fortunately for Peter Jakes, he first leg it's Graham to throw first. Game on. We'll play Graham Usher. Fourth leg. Graham eight. wins, then it's out of his hands. But he would have to rely on Warby to beat Tehan. Few permutations, of course. Final three matches 55. of the session will be Walters against Furness, Peter Jakes against Usher, and Kieran Tian against Mike. Forty nine. Ninety nine. Edged out by Kieran Tian yesterday, 4-3, and 60. Scott Walters, 4-3. These results may come back to haunt him. These two met for the very first time yesterday. 137. And it was Kieran Tian with an 83 average. Who got the better of Graham Usher? 135. Averaged 83 for one. Ninety-six. Ninety-six. Kieran, you require one hundred and fourteen. Eighty-two. Unbeaten so Graham, far you require today. One hundred and thirteen. Tihan. <coughs> three from three. Game shot in the first leg. Graham Usher. Oh, Graham Usher has pulled one out of the bag there. A one-one-three finish. Picks off the fifty-seven. Lands the double eighteen. Second leg is Kieran two. Waiting first. on thirty-two. Eighty-two. One hundred and forty. Eighty. Eighty-five. Sixty. Kieran Tien holds the highest average of this group so far over the two days. One hundred and twenty-three. One hundred and six point two four this morning. Ryan Furness in our opening game. There's a cracker at full three. 139. Graham, you require Graham 153. On to defeat Peter Jakes for one. And then 26. Scott Walters for Kieran, two. Kieran, you require 140. Yeah, Musher opened with a 4 1 win over Warby. Then went down 4-2 to Walters. And then had...
and a 4-2 win over at Finesse. 82. Ryan Meacock gets rid of Andy Bolton. Double quick time, 6-1. Good performance, averaged into the late 90s. Eighty-seven. Kieran, you require fifty-eight. That was a great opportunity for Usher. Four two nil up. Game shot in the second leg. Kieran Tierney today, an eighteen dart hold. Levels things up. One one. The double turn with his last start. Third leg, Graham throwing first. He's found some serious clutch finishing today. 78. <laughs> 140. Forty three. Kieran Tihan wins this one, of course, and one hundred and forty wins it for three. One hundred and twenty five. To win four nil, and then that would be level, so it would have to go to legs one. Sixty. Fear not, as that time approaches, I will give you one hundred. The exact details. Here, you require one hundred and sixty-one. The permutations. Eighty nine. Graham, you require one hundred and fifty five. Take out one three in leg one. Ninety nine. Don't take out the Kieran, you require seventy two. He's left fifty six. Kieran Tian gets the first poke at seventy two. Twenty four left. Double six. Sixty six. Graham, you require fifty six. With the last start in hand. Game shot in the third leg. Usher Graham Usher. Steps in. A 17 dart holder throw to re-establish the lead for the second time in this match. You can feel the tension. Fourth leg. Kieran to throw first. 93. One hundred. Sixty. Well, that's fifteen thousand pounds in prize money tomorrow night. One hundred. Hence, hence the tension. Ninety nine. One hundred and eighty. One eighty makes it sixteen consecutive matches for Graham Usher, where he's hit at least one one eighty. Fifty nine. Graham, you require 121. 89. 100. Graham, you require 32. Game shot in the fourth leg. Graham Usher. Oh, that's a break a throw 
for Graham Usher, courtesy of yet another 180. Leeds 3 1 has the darts. Fifth to leg, wrap Graham this one up. throw first. <coughs> 60. Just ahead in the averages. Not by any significant amount. 131. One hundred and forty. Fifty eight. And Gray Musher piled it on here from three oh one down. Fifty eight. Only fifty eight. Keeps giving. And an opportunity in this leg. Fifty eight. The mistakes are being punished by one hundred and T Ham. One hundred and forty. Graham, you require one hundred and forty-three. Seven eighteen is the shot. Eighty-three. Oh, unless Kieran Tim. Kieran, you require one hundred fourteen. It will be Usher coming back, and he should get two arts at tops. Trouble in team. Forty. Graham, you require 60. 60. Game shot in the match. Graham Usher. And Graham Usher gets it done 4 1 with an 18 dart hold. Three legs on the spin for Graham Usher. An end average of 91.31, 182, 140s, 80% on the doubles. And congratulations to Graham Usher as he wins this Group C and guarantees his place in tomorrow night's final. Plenty of action and some big games to bring you, of course. We've got to decide who finishes in second spot. Up next, Scott Walters against Ryan Finesse.
Good afternoon and welcome back to the Online Darts Live League for our final three matches of Group C, starting with Scott Waters against Ryan Finesse. Dead rubber this one, but confirmation of Graham Usher. Topping the table there. All the players with one more to play. And the big game. Well, the final two matches could be pivotal. If Peter Jakes defeats Graham Usher and Mike Warburton defeats Kieran Tehan. Be Peter Jakes. First leg, who Scott Fiddle, first game on. Sixty. Yeah, I'm not sure on fourteen plus twelve. Thirty nine. He's assured of the top spot. One hundred and twenty one. One hundred. Well, and four to nine waters for this one. It's thirteen to eight for Ryan Finesse. One hundred. Yesterday it was Ryan Finesse who was victorious, four one with an eighty seven forty six. Sixty six percent on the doubles. A high finish of ninety eight four waters average eighty nine thirty four. Another high finish of a hundred. Forty-six. Ryan, you require one hundred and sixty-four. Eighty-four. Scott, you require seventy-six. Game shot in the first leg. Scott Walters. Clinical enough for Walters. Second leg, Ryan to throw first. Opening leg of the match in 17 dart, trouble 20, double eight. 97. 81. 60. Forty-five. One hundred and thirty-four. Eighty-five. One hundred and thirty eight. Yeah, we are back this evening. For the conclusion of Group B. One hundred and forty. Ryan, you require seventy two. Game shot in the second leg. Ryan Furness. Ryan Furness. Levels up. Just Third leg. How many Scott bull team finishes team we've had today? One hundred and forty. Sixty.
81. Sixty. One hundred and thirty-five. Sixty. Scott, you require one hundred and forty-five. 65. 57. So Scott, you require 80. Away. 80. Game shot in the third leg. Scott Walters. Scott Walters does go back in front for the second time. Leads 2-1. Ryan Furness with the darts in leg four. Fourth leg, Ryan to throw first. Sixty. Sixty. One hundred and forty. One hundred and thirty seven. Eighty five. Fifty-eight. Well, opening match this evening was Stephen Burton up against Jim McEwen. Then it will be Charles Barstow against Donald Pilgrim. Then Jim McEwen against our fifth player in the group, Scott Williams. Pilgrim and Williams on six points. One hundred and forty. Ryan, you four. require one hundred and fifty-six. McEwen didn't pick up a win. Was four from four last night. 60. Scott, you require 106. need to go through the card tonight. Starting against Scott Williams in the third match of the session. 86. Ryan, you require 96. 60. Scott, you require 20. For first break, a throw and a 3-1 lead. Over five. Game and shot in the fourth it. leg. Scott Walters. 17 dart breaker throw for Scott Walters. Has the darts in the fifth to wrap this one up. Fifth leg. Scott to throw first. 10 points in 83. the averages. 81 against 91. Over in Holland. Connor Scott. Scott Waits, six piece, seventy and eighty two average for Scott, eighty five average for Waits, one hundred and forty, one hundred and twenty one. One hundred squeezes the treble in with his final dart down to one seven eight. He needs the lot. One hundred and eighty. First one eighty of the match. Seventy seven. Oh. Ryan, you require one hundred and forty. Get why stay there. The trouble twenty was the shot, surely. One hundred. Scott, you require one hundred and one. 
That is just worked it out. Come back for the 20, you see. They've had two darts at top shoot instead Game of shot one, of but one Scott is all Walters. he needs as he goes out in 15 and wins three legs on the spin to defeat Ryan Furness by four legs to one. Average 92 96, four 140s, four out of seven on the doubles. Well, the first of our two big games to come up next as Peter Jakes takes on Graham Usher. Welcome back to the Online Darts Live League for our penultimate match of the session. And it is Peter Jakes against Graham Usher. As you can see, a win here for Peter. And he will go on to 12 points. And then it will be down to Kieran Tehan against Mike Warburton. Peter Jakes can win first this. First leg, it's Peter to throw first. Game Warby on. Warby defeats Kieran Tian. So it will be these two to qualify. 96. Tomorrow night's final. Alongside Nathan Gervin, who has already qualified, 58. of course. And then three from five from tonight's group B. Six players will be divided up into two groups. 58. They'll play each other once in each group. The top two make up our semi-finalists. 58. Winners will play each other in the final. And the winner of that final walks away with £6,000. So that final match 100. is a best of seven. It's a three grand difference. 58. 
Double your dough. One hundred and eighty. Superstar. One hundred and forty. Peter, you require sixty-seven. Yeah, I'm not sure. Won this one four-two yesterday. Was another doubling disaster from Peter Jakes. Just two from twelve on the doubles. He Game shot in the first leg. Eighty-four Peter Jakes. twenty-seven. Graham Usher eighty-one ninety-seven. But no problem on the double there for Peter Jakes. One nil. Second leg, it's Graham to the row first. 15 darter taking out the 67. 140. 42. Jakes is going to have to draw on all that Yorkshire grit. 45. Well, Musher is in no mood to roll over and have his belly tickled here. Even though he's safely through. 140. Course. Second 140 of the leg, 140, 45, 140. 60. 100. 60. Grammy requires 76. game. 56. He'll be back. 58. Live league regular 58. before getting a Graham tour card. Connor 20. Scott seems locked at 3-3 three, three with Scott Waits. Game shot in the second leg. As Graham Graham Usher. Levels things up with a 17 dart hold. One apiece. Third leg, Peter to throw first. It's a must win match for this man. 140. 11 scored. 100. 42. Peter Jakes, who qualified for this week's Champions Week by reaching the final last Saturday night, losing out to Nathan Gervin in that final. 83. 60. 60. Nathan Gervin did average over 102 100. in that final. 85. Peter, you require 78. 54 for 24. There's the 54. that and does game shot in the third leg yeah. peter jakes it's two 15 dart legs on throw so far for peter jakes leads 2-1 fourth leg graham to throw first 67 check out in leg one 78 66 check out in leg three Ninety-three. Love to 
somehow get a break of through. 121. Here, and then he will have the darts in the next leg to try and serve it out. 61. Sixty. Forty eight. Kieran Tia will be one hundred and forty. Watching this intensely, of course. Cheering on Graham Usher. Ninety nine, Graham, you require one hundred and fourteen. Game shot the fourth the leg, Graham Usher. For a fifteen dart finish of his own, taking out the one one four. Fifth leg, Peter throwing first. Now the pressure back on Peter Jakes. 83. In the average. And it's locked at 2 2. It's a must win game for Peter Jakes. 59. And he'll be cheering on Warby against Kieran Tian in our final match of the day. 58. 100. One hundred. Twenty-four. Well, he's going to give himself a bit of breathing space here. One hundred. One hundred and forty. Peter, you require one hundred and sixty. Tops. One hundred and twenty. A tremendous effort. We'll be back. Usher on one seven eight. One hundred. Peter, you require forty. Game shot in the fifth leg. Peter 16 Jakes. 16 dart hold. All holds the throw so far in the match. Five of them. And now it's Graham Usher who has to hold. Six leg. Graham throwing first. 95. Scott Waits leads Connor Scott 5-4. With arts in the tenth 80. leg, and he can do without that. Fifty-five. Just taking a moment there, Peter Jakes showing his experience. Sixty. They'll be all over it, won't they? One hundred. And again, all over the bottom wire. That's Sixty. Indication of pressure. the arm. 97. Tightening of the grip. And again, marginally low. 59. Graham, you require 154. 
134. Sixty. Graham, you require twenty. Game shot in the sixth leg. Graham Usher. Sixteen darter. Our sixth hold of throw. It's three apiece. And Peter Jakes has the darts and has to hold. Seventh and final leg. It's Peter to throw first. Twenty-three and both on sixty-four averages. Sixty. Got away with the sixty there, Peter Jakes. One hundred and thirty-five. Back comes one hundred and twenty-one. Graham Usher. Twenty. Seventy-nine. Forty-two. Forty-two. Fifty-one the lead, plus these. And a sixty. And again. One hundred and twenty-three. Sixty. Peter, you require one hundred and four. Well, it just needs to fall over the line. Double eighteen. Here's double sixteen. Seventy-two. One hundred and thirty-five. Peter, you require thirty-two. Twenty-eight. Well, that is you require disastrous. 83. Sixteen. Twenty-seven. Twenty-eight. Double two. Can he hold it all together? Game shot in the match. Peter Jakes. Oh, he does, and he picks up the win and moves on to 12 points plus five. 83 the average for both. Only one 180 in the match from Peter Jakes and 40% on the doubles. And a high finish of 114 from Usher. Right, our final game of the session up next, and it's Mike Warburton against Kieran Tehan.
welcome back to the Online Darts Live League for our final match of day two of Group C. And it is Kieran Tian against Mike Wolverton. <coughs> and as you can see, Toby Jakes has traded places with Kieran Tian, but a win for Kieran. And it will be himself and Graham Usher to join Nathan Gervin in tomorrow night's final. Defeat, and it will be Usher and Jakes. The pressure on this one. No pressure, of course, on Morby. First leg, it's Kieran going first. Will be Game on. Warby replicates the performance from yesterday's opening match of the session. Where Warby averaged 101.96 in a 4 1 win. Well, averages don't matter here for Kieran. It's just about getting the W and getting the two points. That's 100. What it comes down to the difference between him being in tomorrow night's final and 81. In the mix to win. The six grand or AFH plus fair home. One hundred back to back tons for Warby. One hundred and eighty. Slant on the leg. Forty five. I have to say, this is the best I've seen. Kieran Tihan perform over the ninety two course of a whole day. He's been solid. Only lost one match so far today. One hundred. That was against Table Kieran, you topping. require seventy. Graham Usher. The results from the Jacks Dutch Darts Master in Z it Masters in Zwolle. Three matches down so far over there. Game shot in the first leg. Kieran Tian. Kieran Tian with a super solid fifteen dart hold to throw in leg one. Second leg, it's Mike to throw first. And Crutchmeyer beating Lennon, 6-5. Ryan Meikle defeating Andy Bolton, 6-1. And Scott Waits defeating Connor Scott, 6-4. Or Connor had six darts or so to level it up at five apiece. 140. Scott Waits missed multiple match starts. Up next, another live league regular, Kevin Burness against Ross Smith. 100. Sixty. One hundred. One hundred and twenty five. One hundred and forty. As you say, Kieran Tihan not playing like a man in a one match shootout for a place in the final. Looks fairly unruffled by one hundred and thirty six. Make requires seventy eight. Fifty four twenty four. Eighteen twenty tops. 
the go. Come on, waiting on tops. 38. Kieran, you require 40. Game shot in the second leg. Kieran Tian. A 14 dart breaker throw. And he set a personal best average high in the opening match of today. Third and leg. It's Kieran Tian. But all first. 6.24. And in the final match of the session, he's averaging 103.66 after two legs. 60. I thought he would be a little bit twitchy and edgy. Knowing that it's a all or nothing match. One hundred and forty. Norby not doing too much wrong, averaging nearly ninety five. Sixty. Fifty nine, one hundred and forty. That match against eighty five. Much at match number 12. And Tian, whenever he's needed to find a, another gear, 98. Managed to find one today. 100. Match that ultimately has cost Peter J. 137. <laughs> Match number five against Kieran, you Tian. require 143. Lost 4-1 with a 79-96. He really did have an, an absolute nightmare of a game. I'm sure he won't be able to put his finger on Mike, white. you require 80. Double 10. Game shot in the third leg, Mike Warburton. Mike Warburton has other ideas as he breaks back in 15, taking out the 80. Fourth leg, it's Mike to throw first. Uh, darts used in the legs one so far in the match, 15-14 for Kieran, and that was a 15 for Warby. 60. Good standard. Forty. Been played in round robins before. When you're in this situation, you're sort of thinking, well, what, why are you trying, mate? You're out. There's nothing in this for you, but Six of course, things. all the players are reminded about their responsibility in regards to integrity. Everybody gives it their all. 98. I'm seeing a perfect example of that here. 180. First in the match for Mike Warburton. Is he warming to the task? 85. Is Warby warming up? Sixty. Sixty. Make you require one hundred and forty one. Two left. 
left. 109. The turn to leave 32. Looking like a level game. 134. Peter Jakes. Make you require everything 32. crossed. Sixteen. Kieran, you require eighty four. Game shot in the fourth leg. Kieran Tian. It was absolutely clinical clutch finishing. Three darts at thirty two for Wolby. In steps. Fifth leg, Kieran to throw first. Kieran Tihan taking out the 84 and 2 for the break back. 81. Last three legs have been breaks of throw. And it's Tihan that leads 3 1. 140. Fifty nine, sixty, one hundred and thirty one. One hundred. Fifty eight. Thinking there from one hundred two hundred and thirty points. I know what he's thinking to be here. One forty to leave thirty two. One hundred. Make you require one hundred and one. One oh one. Taking out an eighty. Over sixteen. Game oh. shot in the fifth leg. Oh, Mike the Warburton. 84 was good in the leg before by Kieran Tehan. That was even better for 101. For Wolby. Six leg. It's Mike to throw first. A 15 dart break of throw. Kieran Tehan was just begging for a chance at the 72 to wrap it up. 100. Jake's being put through the ringer. Fifty five. One hundred and forty. Seventy-seven. We'll be with a hundred and eight point lead plus these. Fifty-seven. And, and of course, we'll have one eye on the next leg, the seventh and deciding leg. It's he will have the darts to do it. Fifty-nine. Six. 
60. Forty-five. Make you require one hundred and forty-four. Sixty. See Tihan here starts on nineteens. Five of them need one seventy. One hundred and twenty-six. Make you require eighty four. Not sure of the well, the twenty five would have had one six four, but I think I'd rather go at one three two than fifty nine. One three nine. Kieran, you require one hundred and thirty nine. The twenty five for Wolby. 59 to give us our last make you require 25 in the last game of this group C 17 Kieran you require 80 40 make you require 8 one match start here in Tian and the place in tomorrow night's final 4-2 for Wolby last one in hand and he's stuck Four. It right on the wire Kieran, you require 40. Game shot in the match. Kieran Tien. And somehow, Kieran Tien wins that sixth leg when it looked like we were absolutely nailed on to go to a decider. 86 average for Tien, 84 for Warby. Both players hitting the 1 180. So we know three of our six for tomorrow night's final. Nathan Gervin, Graham Usher, and Kieran Tian. And it is Graham Usher who does win this Group C. So the winner of Group A was Nathan. The winner of this one, Graham Usher, and runner-up Kieran Tian make up three of six. And it will be three from either Burton, Jim McEwen, Chas Barstow, Daryl Pilgrim, or Scott Williams. We resume Group B this evening at 10 o'clock. We'll see you later.